Hi everybody, this is Craig S996 Entertainment and welcome to another video game review on this channel. This time it's another Nickelodeon based video game play. This video game play is, was originally going to be a 2015 video game review, but after a glitch that ended up causing it to freeze, I end up having to I end up having to hold it off until just about now. This is going to be Rugrats Search for Reptar for the PlayStation 1. As you remember last year as you can recall last year I reviewed the Rugrats Studio Tour where we had to save Dill Pickles from the back of that uh, studio vault. And I personally thought I had fun uh, playing uh, the game. It was a it was a fun review. I enjoyed it. And if you're not hearing any sound coming out of my TV, I am muting the audio from the Rugrats intro because Viacom. But I'll go ahead and unmute the TV right now. Reason I decided not to keep the intro audio and audio intros audio intact is because of Viacom. But yeah, I do not have a memory card uh, for my PlayStation right now. Check all the audio. Make sure everything's at a complete setting. Except now, let's get started. Awesome jingle to hear at every episode. Well, and not the entire show, but mainly a bunch of the show. Where's my reptile puzzle? And there is the Rugrats. Okay, kids. Here, have a ball. No! We'll find out, you reptile, even if we got to search the whole wide world. Let's play. Help Tommy win 12 puzzle pieces by completing levels. Search the house for objects that lead to levels and games. Press the triangle button near sparkling objects to start levels. You will earn Tommy's missing puzzle pieces by finishing levels. Press circle to pick up and put down the item that Tommy can play or throw to Spike. Press X, I mean press triangle to throw and use objects. Okay. Turn on the analog. Excuse me. Where's my reptile puzzle? Your reptile puzzle's right there, but... There's how you pick up stuff. You press the circle button and then press triangle to throw. You can also uh, press the triangle to open doors. I'm playing outside. Let's go outside and play with Spike a little bit before we uh, actually start. Good boy. Good doggy. And there's our first Reptar Bar. Also, the Reptar Bars help you earn uh, some uh, puzzle pieces. Now let's go back inside. Mmm, popcorn! Pop popcorn, I love popcorn. I had no idea you could play that. Anyway, on to our first uh, mission. Chucky's Glasses, based off of the Season 2 episode. 
Chucky loses no, his glasses. Baby's looking like you, baby. Oh, dead. I'd rather be broccoli and take a bath at the same time. Because Angelica like play, hates, hates vegetables. Like what? Is the tail on Chucky? How about hide and go eat? No fair. <laughs> <Why be>? Why? <laughs> I feel so bad for Chucky and Jill. I feel so bad for Chucky. It doesn't help that Jill is such a bitch all the time. Help Chucky get his glasses back from Angelica by finding all the Rugrats babies hiding places around the house. Press triangle to tag the baby and then race him or her back to the playpen. Is that you, Angelica? Angelica is nowhere to be seen in this level, except for the cutscenes. <laughs> Sometimes I really hate the camera angle in this game because it is so hard to control constantly. It gets constantly difficult to control. Well, it's really raining. I don't see any cats or dogs falling out of the sky. Is that you, Phil? I don't think so. Phil's not in here. Where are you guys? Well, we're hey, we're trying to find him, Chucky. I'm trying to find him. Is that you, Phil? Lil? Well, I found uh, Phil. Dad. Wrong way. Sorry, gotta run. I think I got him beat. I think I got him beat. Yes, I have. That was easy. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right. Oh, Next one, Grant. Glasses. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Hi, Tommy. Gotcha. Goddamn camera angle. Why'd I do that? Now I gotta run. <laughs> <laughs> At least I beat Tommy. Gotcha. Good job, Chucky. Hey, thank you, Tommy. Now to get Lil. Because they're both hiding in the same area. Get that last Raptor bar real quick. Hi, Lil. Sorry, in this game, rules don't count. That was easy. Yeah, I'm sure it was. I guess I gotta find out. <laughs> <laughs> Off sync music much? I don't feel so good. Here, take your yucky glasses. You look a little sick, Angelica. Now... Ah! You. Let's go clean you up. In the original ending for the episode, Angelica actually pukes on Drew instead of Stu.
All right, time to return to the pickles home. Okay. My reptile puzzle. Play a little bit with the piano. And now let's go upstairs to see what, what we can find in terms of levels or reptile bars. <clears throat> this is my mommy and daddy's room. Good to know. Now we can't do the hard levels yet. We have to at least uh, beat some easy levels. This is Grandpa's room. That's visitors from outer space. <clears throat> it's my room. Well, no reptile bars down here or up here, but let's go back downstairs and try some more easy levels. Now you can press the X button to jump and make your trip down the stairs less difficult. Now let's start the easy hunt. The egg hunt, I meant. Excuse me. <clears throat> That's my Easter egg! Hmm. They're all mine unless you can tile to them first. Huh. Whatever. Greedy Angelica wants all the colored eggs for herself. Quickly gather the house as quickly search the house and gather as many eggs as you can before by running through them before time runs out. Look out for a golden bonus egg. You have a total of three minutes to collect all the eggs. And I'll try and collect every single egg that I can if the camp if the camera control can cooperate with me. Sixteen eggs to go. Watch it, Tommy. Don't want to hurt yourself. <laughs> Love that chicken noise. <clears throat> Okay, we got two minutes left. Actually, no, one minute and 35 seconds is all we got. Here are more eggs. Three. Two. Where's the last? There you are. Got it. Hey, baby, you missed an egg. Your head. What? <laughs> Just to complete that level. <laughs> anyway, that's three reptile bar bars earned. Okay, that's already complete. Where's my reptile puzzle? Yeah, any level that's complete, it, any level that is uh, colored blue is complete. Mmm, popcorn! Now to go on to Ice Cream Mountain. I haven't golfed in ages. <laughs> I'm taking the kids for ice cream, Deed. <laughs> this is gonna be great.
Oh, I bet. Now, this uh, level is based off the episode Ice Cream Mountain from Season 2, originally aired in October 1993. Uncle Stu! Where's the ice cream? At the end of this majestic golf course stands Ice Cream Mountain. That's where I'm going to get a hole-in-one, and when you kids so much ice cream, you'll be eating until you're grown-ups. So what if it's never been done before? It could happen. We gotta get the balls in the holes, and we'll get a whole mountain of ice cream. If we all do some, we'll be done in no time. Approach the ball to make your golf club appear. Press the left or right buttons to aim. Press triangle to start the golf meter. The meter will move up and down. Press triangle again when it has moved to your desired strength. If your number of swings is higher than the far of the hole, you ought to try again. Okay, so our first character is Tommy. I really gotta change that free ice cream policy. But, but, but first, we have to make sure there are no reptar bars. Who made up this around, game anyways? Around the course. Because trust me, people, the places where they hide reptar bars are... Hmm, this is harder than it looks. One Reptar Bar. Ice Cream Mountain Hole 2. One thing I do question this game on, though, is... Actually, one thing I do question on Nickelodeon is... Why isn't Drew in any of the games? I mean, you have Stu and you have Dee Dee. You said ice cream. But why not Drew? Or even Betty and Howard, for that matter. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Make sure there are no reptile bars here. And robots. Okay, back to the ball. This is hard. Polly wagon. Of course. This is the funnest thing ever. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> this is kind of fun. No, 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 man. Oh, great. Now I'm gonna have to try again, probably. This is hard. Alright, Ice Cream Mountain, hole three. And in this level, you play as a dog up. Now be patient, little one. First, we gotta make sure there are no hidden uh, goodies here. Come again soon. Bye bye. Hey, I'm not done yet, buddy. All right. Looks like the place is clear. So. I believe I can try and do it too if. Want some ice cream? Psych! Come on, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it! Yes, made it! Yes! Ah a hole in one! <laughs> How did I manage to make that? Oh, it's sheer dumb luck! What the hell? It almost seems. If everything always seems to be in my favor. I gotta say, it's stupid luck. Very, very stupid luck. Make sure there are no... Again soon! Bye bye Make sure there's nothing there. Also... 
both the uh, film will only get one hole each. I really gotta change that free ice cream policy. Three levels you get to play as uh, Tommy, two levels you get to play as Chucky and Angelica, and only one level for Phil and only one level for Lil. I guess the show just really does not like these two. Got it! Ice Cream Mountain Hole 5. This is Lil's Hole. Gotta go through that windmill. But first, come again soon. Bye bye. Make sure there are no goodies hidden in here whatsoever. Okay, there seems to be nothing there, so let's go back. Did somebody say ice cream? And this is a part five. I hope I can make it. Gotcha. Instead of ice cream, how about a nice plastic spider? Nah, I didn't think so. You're a dick. Ah, that's what I get for calling the guy a dick. All right, Spangle Guy. That's on the show. Or the Spangle. I've forgotten what the guy's name is in the Ice Cream Mountain episode, but the guy's a jackass. Want some ice cream? Psych. Asshole. Make sure there are no hidden goodies here. Don't glitch it. Yeah, one thing I try to avoid uh, in any of my gameplays here on the Craig S996 Entertainment Network is glitching the game. I'll get the ice cream mountain if it takes till nap time. If you say so, Tommy. Just gotta give me some time to make sure there are no goodies. Wow! Took a complete stop there. Okay. Oh! Where's that ice cream? Just missed it. Just almost made it. Ice Cream Mountain, Hole 7. The Reptar theme. This would pretty much become the common theme for Reptar starting in Season 4 when the new episodes come around. You want a year's supply of nothing. Screw you. change that free ice cream policy. Don't even think about it, buddy. This is the funnest thing ever. Wow! Managed to make that. Okay, then. The 
first episode I remember hearing the Reptar theme was Fair Play, that season 4 episode that originally aired in 1998. Actually, let me be let me be more specific. Originally aired on September 1997. September 1997. Excuse me, not 1998. I really gotta change that free ice cream policy. Also, a shout out to Jamar 500, who's a big Nickel, who was a big Nickelodeon fan in all of its game shows. Looks like I'm gonna have to perform a mercy shot, people. Move it, ball! Because Angelica. She's always a bitch. And she's pretty much spoiled due to her parents. Well, pretty much because of Charlotte's uh, neglect towards her. Well, I shouldn't say neglect. Her business, uh... Again soon! Bye bye Primarily her business to... to then her daughter. And... I mean, up this game anyways. Both... Yeah, both Stu and Drew constantly fight. Well, when you expect their brothers, they fight Don't too. Ice cream? Psych. Hell, I'm the oldest in my family, and I fight with my sister a lot. At least my, uh, at least the sister who is, uh, 18. Now, where's that ice cream? Wow. We did it! Yay! Good job, kids. Now I'm gonna get you all the ice cream you can eat. Because it's free. And we earned another puzzle piece out of that game. And that is going to conclude for episode one of me playing Rugrats Search for Reptar on the PlayStation 1. And we will continue with episode two of the game coming up next.